Welcome back to Let's Play Halo Anniversary. You guys want to calm the fuck down? <laughs> I'm Burning Dog Face, and me and these excitable Marines here are on board the Truth and Reconciliation, a Covenant cruiser. Normally we just want to blow it up. Right now, we need to find Captain Keys and save him. Funny, the door was opening, so I assumed there was an invisible dude there. I mean, you see the logic, right? Ah! Uh, sorry, everybody looks the same through the visor. Maybe they'll buy that. Oh, there we go. I can just uh, undo my mistake. Cortana to Echo 419. The shuttle bay door is open. You can start your approach. Thou canst start thine Roger. approach. Echo 419 inbound. I have played through this game on Legendary, only in co-op, but, uh, first word of advice, don't try to save the Marines. It's not just that there's more of everything in, uh, Legendary mode. They have, uh, way more health, and they deal, like, damage into half, I think. You see, the best use for me of the Needler is to just fill a corridor with exploding crystals and hope for the best. I need those. I didn't say my bones and organs this time because, as mentioned before, the, the Spartans have unbreakable bones. So for once, it's not a concern. Yeah, if I had to complain about one major thing about Halo, it's that they reuse sections of levels a lot. Like, they made this, you know, Covenant Corridor, and then they made every corridor in the ship look like this. Or did you just notice I was here? I do like revisiting this same room from different levels, that's kind of cool. There's another level later on where it's uh, particularly bad, even though those ones are differentiated, it turns out. Not a terminal. Looks like your eyes aren't focusing properly. That was, uh, an extraterrestrial. Oh. Ooh, that's not good for your spine. Hey, hey! What the hell? You're not one of ours! You know, they noted, uh... I remember it being noted on the internet that every jackal in this game uses a plasma pistol, but it's the weapon that's most effective against them, because you can charge up a shot and take out their shields. You know, it would make much more sense to arm them with the Needler, because Needler rounds bounce off of their shields totally harmlessly. And, uh... You know, it just makes sense for the, to arm them with a weapon that cannot then be turned against other jackals. That's where we came from. I'm gonna grab that grenade, though. I don't need to grab that grenade, though. What the? Or, hmm. No, no, we did come out this way. Yeah, that's right. I got turned around. Like I said...
figure it's probably not going to be one of these. That's the terminal. They're probably going to have like a you know a new thing stuck somewhere that isn't in the old graphics. Ooh, ooh, that was a. Mm. Every time I switch it over, I'm immediately struck by how much uglier it is, but then I realize that there is still a great level of detail in these textures and such. Like, it looks pretty fucking good for 2001. Yikes. Honestly, this is one of my favorite games. I just didn't mention that right off the top because I was afraid that would give certain expectations to my skill level. Oh, never mind. This has got to be where the terminal is. I forgot we went to the bridge. Oh, that guy's got a sword. No, you are not the priority. Oh, shit! Oh. Think of it as a lightsaber and you're not far off. Damn, I really should have kept that sniper rifle. Ah, well! Oh, he survived the initial explosion. Great. Yeah, the uh, the ones above red level are really fucking tough. And that guy looked like a ship commander. Uh, shit. Okay, that one. Let's go there. Okay, fine. I'll be smart about it and take out the lesser threats first. No, 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 not if you're going after my mans. You've killed him. You bastard. Damn, if that one isn't satisfying. Earlier, I killed a guy when I wasn't recording, and a marine, the marine right next to me, said, accused me of stealing his kill. I backtracked. Let me just check something up here. Press X to use terminal. I had a feeling it would be the flashiest object in the room. I wonder what this will spoil. Can I see the pause menu for a second there? Who is your maker? Sadness and disrepair. I am hungry. I was not made. Never made? But you are right here, where you should not be. Tell your charges to cease their efforts immediately. Or a team must not be violated. It's a covenant AI. Holy shit. Construct, respond. Jungle grass. Familiar terms. I serve. None serve me, Oracle. Your charges must cease all aggression towards the reclaimers and leave this installation at once. Construct, you are dangerously close to unleashing a force you cannot comprehend. Oh, good. I was wondering about that. This is most inappropriate. We follow the path, and I am part of the stone journey swarm that serves. I, we serve. They will find, and then I will be free. Find? Free? Explain yourself. I know their path, and when they are gone, only I shall remain, and then free. This is quite unsatisfactory, Construct. Your core shows no hint of understanding the gravity of this situation. I will return later for your proper decommissioning. 
Well, unless the flood kills us all first, in which case the point will be moved. Good day, Construct. I ain't saying nothing. That's really neat. Adding something to the story of Halo. I really like that. Where the fuck are we going, anyway? You can't actually push the button when you're in old graphics mode. Neat. Oh, look at that! I like that! It's like a... You know, it's, it's just a fucking metal plate here, but it's a force field here. That's why I assumed I was able to drop it. Okay, Cortana, now would be a great time to throw me a bone. Ooh, that looks important. So if it costs as much to make a starship as a suit of Mjolnir armor... I think these guys really need to work on their cost-effectiveness. My goodness, the motion tracker telling me where the enemies is at. I'll say this about that last cutscene. Oh. The, uh... The Covenant hate... humans, and they hate the Master Chief more than most humans. There is only one enemy... that the Covenant fear. Oh hell. I didn't realize I was fucking surrounded. Oh dear, I didn't throw the sticky kind. Yes! They run faster than I do, so that was very nerve-wracking for me. supposed to be interrupted there. I'm just saying. Come on. Come on. Yes! I'll have you out of there in a jiffy, sir. Oh, I'm almost out of bullets. I hope they left that dead guy with his guns. There we go. Coming here was reckless. You two know better than this. Thanks. Marines, lock and load your weapons. Let's be ready to move. Yes, sir. While the Covenant had us locked up in here, I overheard the guards talking about this ring world. They call it Halo. One moment, 
sir. Accessing the Covenant Battle.net. According to the data in their networks, the ring has some kind of deep religious significance. If I'm analyzing this correctly, they believe that Halo is some kind of weapon, one with vast, unimaginable power. Uh, that's true. The Covenant kept saying that whoever controls Halo controls the fate of the universe. Now I see. I have intercepted a number of messages about a Covenant search team scouting for a control room. I thought they were looking for the bridge of a cruiser that I damaged during the battle above the ring. But they must be looking for Halo's control room. That's bad news. If Halo is a weapon and the Covenant gained control of it, they'll use it against us and wipe out the entire human race. Chief, Cortana, I have a new mission for you. We need to beat the Covenant to Halo's control room. Marines, let's move. Yes, sir. sir. Okay, sir. Chief, you have the point. Shut up and get behind me, sir. I like them all arming themselves with Covenant we weapons when they're murdered captors. Holy shit, they really did. Ah, oh, fucking cloakers. Used to be easier to see them with a... You ass! Uh, oh, wait, it's the captain with the needler. Oh, shit. <laughs> oh, you're just shooting the dead guys! Yeah, they do that sometimes. It's like, oh, no, there's more. But they seriously, I have seen them just run up and say, uh, I'm not done with you yet! Holy fuck, Cap'n! This guy had 600 bullets on him. I'm actually really impressed with the minimal hand animation in these cutscenes, given that everyone had mitten hands in the original oh, graphics. That had to be something they added when they were doing the uh, anniversary edition. Oh. Oh, we haven't been to this one yet. Jesus Christ. I hate to do this. It makes me feel like a mercenary. Missed it. I was just curious. I know that was the one without any shit on it. What the fuck? Oh, there's one further. Okay, I'm just losing my goddamn mind. That's why. Well, when in Rome, do as the Covenant do. I don't know. No, that's where we came from. So I guess we're supposed to uh, retreat back to the... Uh, Oh, back to the hangar. If only I didn't have the sense of direction <clears throat> of a stupid dog wrapped up in a towel. No! You've no. murdered him. Look, a Mark V. I return to Shuttle Bay for extraction. Predator-ass motherfuckers. Well, there's more ammo in the next room. Oh shit, he wasn't moving. I actually checked that time. Oh, 
Well, there's the timer. I gotta get a checkpoint now. You be dead! Or, you know, failing that, die. But hopefully not that hard. Fuck! I think this is the first game I ever played with overheating weapons. Keep it up, bro. That's what I'm talking about. Like, even the concept of overheating weapons, I mean. I find myself wondering exactly how, uh... Oh, there was a checkpoint right there! All right, then in that case... I, uh, I'm Burning Dog Face, and I'll see you next time on Let's Play Halo Anniversary when we continue extracting Captain Keys to the safety of the hangar. I don't even remember what I was just saying, so I can't finish that thought. Silly! <sighs> I'll see you later, Burning Dog fans. Have a good one!